What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're tackling a common enemy of smooth phone performance, cache buildup. If your iPhone feels sluggish, apps are crashing, or storage is tight, clearing your cache might be the cure. In this video, we'll explore six powerful ways to clear your iPhone's cache. Let's get started. Fix one, force restart. Sometimes, a force restart can work wonders. It clears temporary data and can free up cached memory. Depending on your iPhone model, the force restart method will differ. Here I show the force restart way in detail the models after the iPhone 8. For iPhone 8 or later, press and quickly release the volume up button. Press and quickly release the volume down button. Then press and hold the side button. And let it go when you see the Apple logo. System data cache may be the culprit for insufficient storage space. Next, I'll show you how to clear the different caches on your iPhone. Fix 2. Offload and used apps. Head to Settings. General. iPhone Storage. Click Show All in the upper right corner. Then you can enable the Automatically Offloading and Used Apps button. Fix 3. Clear App Caches. Of course, you don't always need to delete apps completely. Find the app you want to offload, then choose Offload App. Offloading lets you keep app data while freeing up storage by removing app files. This is ideal for apps you use occasionally. In addition, some apps also accumulate their own cache. Many of them offer built-in liquidation options, like Snapchat. You can also find Clear Caches option in its settings. Fix 4. Clear the Safari Cache Safari holds a lot of data of caches on your iPhone. Go to Settings, scroll down, and find Safari. Then scroll down again, and clear its history and website data. Fix 5. Empty Recently Deleted Album Deleted photos still hang around in the recently deleted album for 30 days, taking up space. So it'd be a wise move to do it manually delete them instead of letting it empty itself automatically every 30 days. Fix 6. Refresh iOS with Reiboot. If your iPhone is still sluggish after trying these methods, there might be deeper system issues. So I recommend you use Reiboot. It can scan and repair your iOS system, potentially clearing hidden cache and resolving performance problems. Once downloaded, connect your iPhone to the PC or Mac. Then choose the green Start Repair button. Then you'll be downloading a firmware. Just click on it. Select the standard repair so we can maintain the data. The whole process takes about 10 minutes. When the repair is completed, you can go ahead and check it out. Fix 7. Reset and Restore Your iPhone this is a more drastic measure, but sometimes a factory reset can be the ultimate cache cleaner. Remember to back up your data before proceeding. And then, after the process is done, you can restore everything back from your backup. And then the caches will be gone by then. It sounds a bit complicated, so I think a better alternative is to use Reiboot. So that's all for today. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more tech tutorials. See you next video.